So this video is titled How I Learned How to Use the Baylor at Work. Alternatively titled, but YouTube unfriendly, is I Fucked the Baylor at Work. So if you're Alan, you're probably going to be sitting here going, Oh my god, how the fuck did she do it? But I'm not surprised. And if you're not Alan, you might be going, what the fuck is a baler? So at work, we have this big crashing machine that um, compacts cardboard boxes and the like into an easy transportable cube. Easy transportable cube. And um, what the fuck am I doing? And um, so it uses baling twine and a system of knots to keep the press together. And the twine is fed through three holes. Um, can't for the life of me fucking remember what one of the second holes does, but it goes in through the back, out through the front, in through the back, and then it go. It's fed down to um, go underneath the um, cube of cardboard, so you can then like pull the twine down from the top and then you know tie it up, and there you go. So, in the process, you need to feed the twine through, like cut the twine, feed the twine, tie it to the bottom, tie it back up, and then you've got yourself a compact cube. Now, you're supposed to cut between the second and the third hole, and that's because, um, well, obviously, you're left with the one string that's not fed through anything. I cut underneath the first hole. So I tried to... So like, the twine had come through the first hole and I had that sitting up. But then the twine was sitting, was going through the second hole, back through, back through the second, out the third, and, you know, underneath. And what I tried to do was effectively, because the twine was still wrapped around that hole, I tried to tie the baler to the cube of cardboard. And you also need to tie knots to keep the twine together. And knots are so big that they can't go through the fucking holes that the twine's through. So I sat down and went, boss, can you please check my work for me? I think I fucked it. And he looked at it and went, yeah, you fucked it. How do we fix it? So, um, apart from that, he said though, uh, apart, apart from uh, cutting it in the wrong spot, I did, I did everything else right. Um, but it was like, 20, 20 to 2 uh, when we figured out the mistake and he went, uh, nah, just just go home. So um, that's the story of how I learnt to use the baler at work.